to the World Tarot, this is a reading for the sign of Libra for the week starting the 14th to the 21st of February 2022. Holy Spirit, show me the Libras who need to hear these messages for the coming week. Holy Spirit, show me the Libras. Three of Cups reversed. King of Swords, that's Libra. So, you're not feeling in a very celebratory mood this week. You don't want to work with others, maybe you don't want to party. You could be getting um, invitations, right? Dates. People want to go on dates with you, maybe for Valentine's Day, and you're going to turn them down. You're going to be very cold and detached. You're going to be uh, weeding them out also. You're going to be very stern with who you give your energy to. You're not interested in dating right now. Okay, so you might get some people you're not interested in coming towards you. Anyone interesting though? <coughs> oh, yes, a new love. Okay, so you might be getting free people who are trying to go out with you somewhere. Also, your friends might want to go out on some kind of um, single girls night. But you're getting some new love offer here. Or boys night. So what's the new, who is the new person here? It could be a water sign. Who is the new person? My nose started itching when I said water sign. Who is the new person for Libra? Holy Spirit, who is this new person for Libra? Who is the, the two of pentacles? And the knight of swords. Could be another, uh, they could have air in their chart too. Of pentacles. This could be somebody who is juggling you with another person, but it could also be somebody who is uh, quite entertaining. Maybe they tell nice jokes or they're interesting somehow. They could be very good with their hands, maybe. Knight of Swords came out again. Maybe it's a Gemini. Because the main court, court cards we have here are Libra and Gemini, so you could be dealing with a Gemini. Ten of Pentacles, this is Capricorn. Two of Pentacles, that was Taurus. And this is any water sign. So there you go. <coughs> this is somebody who wants commitment. This person could be very good, both with their hands and their mouth. Okay, whatever. I said it. There you go. <laughs> whatever kind of job they do, they could be very um, manual, okay? So... What does this person, what are these person's intentions towards you? What are this person's intentions towards you? What are this person's intentions towards you? Uh, to hold you tight, maybe. But they could also be holding back. But uh, yeah, with the Knight of Cups and the Four of Pentacles, I think they want to hold you tight. They're very romantic. They like to hug and kiss and stuff, I think. Is this person a hopeless romantic? Yes, they are. Okay, there you go. Right. So you might like that. You might not. Depends. They're also pretty rational. They're kind of like you in some ways, though. Okay. Seven of Wands. With the Fool and the Seven of Wands, this person could be quite popular. Maybe this person is very sought after. Lots of people like this person. <coughs> yeah, just like I said. Yeah, yeah. this person is very popular. They could be famous online. They could be famous worldwide. With all these cards, the Fool, the Seven of Wands, Six of Wands, Queen of Wands, they all talk to me about fame and popularity. So this person could actually be famous. There you go, Libra. So Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries again. This person could have all the fire signs in their chart. But when I see a lot of fire, like I said, it could be somebody who's very, very popular. Okay. Three of swords on the bottom of the deck. But it could be kind of a heartbreaker. Is this person trying to get you to sleep with them only? Four of Wands. I think they want serious commitment. Oh, but the, this is a yes to me. They do want to sleep with you. But I think they also... 
they might see you as very popular too. They might see you as very popular too, and that's why they want to... This could be an Aries. This could be our opposite sign. Maybe this is your twin flame, actually. Is this your twin flame? Maybe you didn't know who your twin flame is, or whatever. Your partner, the person you're supposed to be with. In a commitment. Six of Pentacles. Hmm. This is definitely some kind of soulmate with a Six of Pentacles here. This is. This could also be somebody from your past. Can you trust this person, whatever they are? <coughs> Knight of Wands, their player. No, you can't trust them. They want to sleep with you only. Look how much fire I've got for this person. They're a heartbreaker, yeah. Three of Swords with the Knight of Wands. That's 100% heartbreaker. They just want to sleep with you and then go away. And they might like you because you're popular. This person's popular. You're popular. It will make them look good if they sleep with you. Okay. Right, so we wasted time on this one. Anyone else trying to come towards you? So this is a new love. I said it's somebody from the past, but it could be like a past life soulmate, but I don't know. Anyway, it's a new love here. King of Wands, more fire. Yeah, this person's a player, 100% player, and they're very popular, and you're popular, and they think that's going to make them look good. This is This is a person who's obsessed about their image. Oh my god, they have so much fire. And maybe air too. Free yourself. Eight of Swords. Free yourself from this person. Stay independent. Knight of Cups. They're gonna love bomb you. They're trying to manifest you. Don't let them. Love yourself. <laughs> I think this person has two other people, maybe a water sign and an earth sign that they're dealing with. They have to choose between these two people, or you will have to choose between a, a, a water sign and an earth sign later. But yeah, this person is coming towards you, but they are also having these two people. I think that's what it is. They're pretending to be single, but they actually have two other people that they are talking to. Okay, yeah, there's there's somebody who's going to be watching. There's There are men who watch tarot readings to find out what women want. Maybe particular signs want. And they're watching to see what this woman expects. And they're going to come in pretending to be the soul soulmate or twin flame that you're waiting for. This women, uh, Men have learned to do this. Uh, the manosphere is watching and they've learned this trick now. Yeah, to win at all costs. Yeah, what did I say? Five of Swords, Seven of Swords. They're sneaky. They think they're sneaky. They're watching and they're learning how to defeat the enemy because they see women as the enemy. They see women as this group of men. I'm not saying all men. But there are lots of men who get together on these online forums and they talk about how to get women, as many women as possible, so they can look popular, right? Because that's their only concern in life. So yeah, they're they're willing to do anything. They they want to win at all costs. So they're doing very Machiavellian things here in the dark, watching these tarot readings. There you go. Fifty-seven or seventy-five could also be significant. King of Pentacles. This person is gonna present themselves as being very abundant, possibly. <coughs> this person could be very abundant. They could be very popular. But all they want is to get other popular people to sleep with them. Women specifically. Women folk. <laughs> Three of Pentacles. Ten of Swords. There could be a group of men who are doing this actually. <coughs> Ten of Swords, yeah. This is betrayal. Backstabbing and betrayal. They're very sneaky. It's a bunch of sneaky men watching the readings. Nine of Cups reverse, nine of Eight of Cups. There's no wish fulfillment with this person or these people, even if they might promise commitment. So walk away from them. Yeah. 
Any good offers coming towards you though? Any good offers coming towards Libra? Any good offers coming towards Libra? Five of Cups, Seven of Pentacles. You need to wait. <laughs> yeah, take a break from dating. Just, uh, yeah. Um, you, might feeling, you might be feeling sad. You might be feeling sad and lonely and you're manifesting um, negative things towards you right now. You might need to get over some kind of grief. Be patient with yourself. You need healing. <coughs> you need to heal from something from the past still. You could still feel like a victim. You could be very guarded. There could have been a relationship that you thought was the best and it wasn't. Also, you might be getting a better relationship after you heal. But you'll need to be patient with yourself. Anything else? Four of Cups. For now, reject all offers. That's what you're shown. So, I hope this helps. Again, be patient with yourself. Put in a consistent effort towards healing yourself. But don't strain yourself, right? Don't beat yourself up. Try to be patient again. Lots of patience. <coughs> I hope this helps. Take care.